All right guys, what's up? So today we are doing a little Q&A where we asked you some questions on Twitter and this kid smiled about it, thought it was funny. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so we're gonna answer your questions. Also, some of you guys asked specific questions for Audrey. Oh. So, Catherine says, Audriana, who is your favorite princess? Um, oh, I know, Rapunzel. Rapunzel, why? Why is she your favorite? Because, you know, because it has Max Maximus in it, and, and he's a horse, and I like riding horses, and Seth, Oh, for all these uh, yeah, it's called the alphabet. At Babo One says, "What's your favorite thing to eat in Kansas? Have you Whoa. ever ate at Gates?" Gates yeah. is good. I think it's good. I, like Gates. I personally like Jack Stack. Jack Stack, yeah. Jack Stack is the best barbecue to me. So, if you guys don't know much about Kansas City, where we live, um, Kansas City is known for like its barbecue. And we have the best barbecue, all right? Let's just put it out there. Memphis, Carolina, they have barbecues, but it's just not Kansas City barbecue. But yeah, Jack Stack is probably the best. So Tay-Tay has a question for you. Isn't that a cool name, Tay-Tay? Say, what up, Tay-Tay? What up, Tay-Tay? Hi, Tay-Tay. Okay, so she says, Audrey, what's your favorite thing to eat at Chipotle? Um, apple juice. <laughs> <laughs> apple juice? What do you get to eat at Chipotle, though? <gasps> Quesadilla and rice is so yummy. At Music Life 6781, I don't know what all those numbers are for, but they sound cool. She said, who is your favorite child to buy clothes for? I figured this is probably a good question for you. Um, <laughs> I mean, I like, little boy clothes are cute, but hands down, Audrey, I always find her the cutest things. And I, there's times where I'm actually specifically going for them and I'll still come back with like, a dress. And <laughs> It's just so hard. And she's a shopper. If I tell you, yeah. she, she, girlfriend can shop. Like, Every time we go to H&M, she's like, she's like she does oh, the whole the whole thing where you go up and you just go. <laughs> <laughs> and you just move the clothes around for no reason just to look at it. <laughs> it's like a workout. <laughs> it's like a new dance move. <laughs> Coming to the clubs this year. No, sorry, bro. You get left out. Not really. You get plenty of clothes. Oh, FYI, guys, Kylan is napping. He yes. He cannot stay awake to be part of this video. Sorry. We didn't disown him as one of our children. He's still our child. He's just really tired. Ella Bieber says, Hey, Audrey, can you sing me your favorite song? Um, Jesus, what I know. For the Bible, tell me, sir, let your words be open up. <laughs> That's your song. You dropped from your googly eyes. That was interesting. Maddie says, would you guys ever adopt? Uh, yeah, we've talked about adoption. Yeah, we have talked a lot about adopting because I think, and this was another question that people were asking, are you having more kids? I don't know. We, we're not gonna answer that right now. Ooh. But I, I, <laughs> I feel like the last time we said no, then I got pregnant. So That's so I true. feel like I really don't wanna have any more right now. So to be announced, but no, cause yeah. no. Actually, that's so true because I remember we made a video on her channel and it was another Q&A and someone asked that and we were like, no, we're not having kids. And then when we were pregnant with Maddox, everyone was sending us that video like, what happened to this? Michelle says, how do you guys stay healthy? My lunch today. Yeah, wait, what is this? It looks gross. I Instagram a picture of it. It looked good. It, oh, this is can, can I stop you right quick? Let me talk about this right quick. Hey, I have an Instagram picture <laughs> in over a week. So let me just say that first of all. It was so cute. I like, I was sitting here. And then I look over and I see her, she's like touching, she's like moving her bowl like half an inch. And I was like, what? I was like, because I thought she was about to eat. I was like, what's she doing? Then I realized. I'm getting ready to answer that. But yeah, so what are you eating? Um, this is my go-to lunch. It's, I love it. I cut up a cucumber, tomato, a tiny bit of avocado, and then they, Trader Joe's has these black bean quinoa chips, and I dip it in there, and it's so good. And then Trader Joe's also has these little, this is something new. They're like flavored, um... There's no sugar Spritzers, anymore. seltzers. Ah, oh, guys, this is like my go-to lunch. <laughs> That's how I stay healthy. I um, have no oh, comment, God. honestly. <laughs> uh, how do you stay healthy? Yeah, uh, you, you actually, you said something when you walked over. How do you stay healthy? Um, I stay healthy with carrots and ranch and broccoli. Ooh, that's yeah. very good. How else do you stay healthy? Um, how maybe gain some energy or like, like, Jumping on a trampoline like this. Gain some energy, good job. Gain you know, some energy, you know, all right. What's your like, favorite way to exercise? Like, like this. Oh. Running. Oh, running, by running? running? Oh my. Gen Z says, were Audrey and Kylan excited about having a baby brother? Yeah. I don't know. You were? Yep, I was very excited. Look how cute I am. Like every single day, I do things to be cuter and cuter. Look at me, look at me. Guys, who would not be excited to have me? <laughs> 
has his little baby brother. I'm so cute. I don't even have to try. I'm so cute. I don't do anything except sit here and I'm cute. Cute AF. <laughs> Stephanie Clark says, when do you think you'll start potty training Kylan? Mm, <laughs> probably pretty seen, soon. We've already kind of started a little bit. Yeah. I mean, every time I use the bathroom, I usually tell him to come with me and he sits on his potty. Um, but guys, I'm not trying to rush it. I yeah. think that's one thing, the more kids you have, you learn about parenting, is don't rush things when it comes to like, switching to toddler beds, yeah. potty training, things yeah. that are going to be really hard on you. Don't rush it, because it's not going to be hard enough, let alone trying to like, make it happen. He just turned two in November, it's not like he's like five, he's fine. Yeah. So, I like to potty train in the summer and spring because you're outside more, you're in shorts, it's just easier, yeah. plus he's a boy, so if we're out and he has to pee in the bushes or something, you know. <laughs> Uh, That's a boy thing that we get that. to do. <laughs> I think it's easy to think, oh, I have to do this this way or do that this now. Yeah. But then we forget about things like, do you still poop in a diaper? No. <laughs> like, you're gonna, yeah. you, humans figure it out. Okay, yeah. so he's going to do that eventually. And he's actually, yeah, he's taking a lot of steps. So, yeah, he'll he's, be he's doing good though. Diana Martinez says, do you see any similarities between Maddox, Kylan, and Audrey? Uh, well, well yeah, Maddox and Audrey sure. look the exact same also, as babies. Also, personality-wise, well, I think Maddox is going to be a mix because sometimes yeah. he reminds me of Audrey. He's a very alert baby. She was super alert and like, I mean, Kai was alert, but he's a lot like her where he just watches everything. Uh, but he's also very mellow and she wasn't the most mellow baby. I feel yeah. like I mean, she had her moments, but she was kind of high strung. They look alike. I mean, yeah, they all look obvious. alike. I mean, but personality-wise, I feel like all have very distinct personalities. Well, Audrey is extraordinarily outgoing. Yeah, Audrey, I just love Audrey's confidence and how, um, I love how just sweet and loving she is. Oh, that's something they have in common. Kylan, they're both very loving, like yeah. kids. Like, they were yeah. seeing at lunch day just being like, I love you, I love you. I mean, and I know most people <laughs> love you, but I just feel like they're very expressive. Yeah. Which is cute. And then... I really like Kylan's, like, individuality. Like, he's yeah. his own person yeah and he's also the shy through kid which yeah. i love because i was a shy kid like, <laughs> it doesn't seem like it when you see the videos because at home he's outgoing but when yeah. we go somewhere he like gets very shy and very shy it's really cute and he goes mm. and he makes weird noises <laughs> okay guys oh do you have something to say to the peeps um this smoke to remind you if there's an edible fire and there's smoke on the ceiling and also a smoke protector on wings you should get out of the house quick. If a smoke protector rings? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's very good advice, Ash. We've That's been reading books so about fire smart. safety. Yeah. Nailed it. So what do you do if there's a fire? Well, if you if you, if there's and also if an, another thing, if there's an apple, apple, um, 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 fire on your clothes, drop, stop, cover your face, and roll. Oh, that's that so, so good! Man, she legit. Wait, that was didn't they the teach her that? Book. No, it was from the library. Oh, we read it about seven times, and you really remember? Stop, drop, and roll. So and you good. remember to cover your face? That's really good eyes. Yeah, that's actually true. I don't even know that. I just know stop, drop, and roll, and right. I'll burn my face she off. Leia loves Darren. Says, where would you like to go for your next vacation? Um, um, I know where I would like to go for. My <laughs> where next would you like to go for your next vacation? Um, oh, I'd like to go to. Oh, wait. No, no, no. That's the way where we went. Um, Kansas. Yes, Kansas. Kansas? Mm, yes, I love Kansas. Oh, well, that's funny because you ain't going nowhere. Next vacation is <laughs> me and Daddy. Uh, uh yup. Where would I like to go on our next vacation? Anywhere? Yes. Yeah, I probably would agree with Brittany. Anywhere that we get to go where yeah. there's no kids. I can't really think of anywhere that would be terrible to go if there yeah. were not kids. I mean, even if it was somewhere cold, as long as there's like an indoor place to Yeah, sit I want to go to like Chicago. Yeah. Anywhere without kids. I love my kids. <laughs> All right, so that's it. Thanks for asking your questions. We loved uh, reading them. Also, guys, Brittany has a new video up on her channel today. A little update on this little booger boy. Hey, big cheek boy. <laughs> Why does he laugh what so What was that cute? little laugh all that about? That was so cute, little friend. But yeah, so her video's up now, so you can go check that out. And uh, yeah, we will see you guys on Monday. And Thanks for watching. And also, um, you gotta know this. <laughs> If there's ever a fire on your clothes, drop, cover your face, and roll, and then fly. I'll get you in the nose. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Uh, bye. Oh, kiss now. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>